I get a jar of death. What's going on you guys? My name is Kobe Downey and welcome to another awesome video. In this video I'll be showing you how to use SolarWorks and 3D printing to make awesome things. So, what does a bottle of wine and a jar of Nutella have in common? Well, if you take that jar of Nutella, eat it. Unpopular opinion, I'm not a fan of Nutella. Finish that jar of Nutella, clean it out, get rid of the labels, print an awesome Nutella jar holder and you got yourself a little wine glass. It's grape juice. It's 10 o'clock in the morning. Or is it? So this is a little process I call upcycling. The idea of it is that you give a second home or a second use to an object instead of just throwing in the trash and it either going into a landfill and being recycled into a less inferior product. Whenever I'm about to throw something out, I look at it and I try to figure out what else could I do with this? What extra use can I do with this? My wife hates this because there are tons of boxes stored in our kitchen because I don't like throwing them away because I like to use them, store stuff in it. And that's a good example. I mean, also one thing I like to do is all these little jars from these desserts, I like to keep them because I use them to keep screws for things that I'm building or, or disassembling, just keep it in order, as well as just keeping little Lego bits loose while I'm building my Lego kits. <laughs> but Nutella jars, you know, they, you pay, I think it's pound fifty here in the UK for them, and you munch it away and you throw it away. So using SolidWorks and 3D printing, you know, I wanted to 3D print some objects that give these Nutella jars a second use. And the first one is a nice little wine glass using a little organic technique that I like to use now and then. PTG was probably not the best material for this, it's quite a stringy material, but I like the color of it. The second use I'm, uh, I used is to make a little planter, also PTG didn't print too well. So I reprinted it in PLA, put a little succulent in there, found some dirt, and made this awesome little planter right here, which is quite cute. So I'm gonna go through how I made these, uh, these two models, little tricks and techniques that I used to design this. Whether you use these same techniques in something similar or something completely different, that's up to you. So let's get into how I made these awesome models.
So I hope you learned a lot from that. I hope this inspired you to just have a second look at those things that you throw away and see if you can use SolidWorks and 3D printing to give them a second home or a second use. Lovely thing about these 3D printers is that within a matter of hours you are reviving an object that would just be put into a landfill or recycled. It's an interesting little concept and a fun way to look after the environment because that's very important. So it will be really cool if you guys like this video. If you have any questions, please leave them down in the comment section below. We'll see you guys in the next one. Where did that bottle cap go?